Oh, we've got a double hookup. I think they're both um, blackfish. Hey Jeff, I'm just keep fighting the fish until the front. Oh, it's nice blackfish. Hey, yeah, you should hop over to the other ledge and um get it up. You should hop over to that ledge. Okay, winding it, keep winding it. And then I'm lifted up sideways. It's blackfish. It's a good fish. First fish, first black fish, pretty good. <laughs> it's a good size though. That's a good fish. どうぞ。Don't pull it too hard. Ooh. Hey, just get the rod up, just get the rod up. Careful, 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 careful. Oh, oh yeah, I'm missing a basket off. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah, blue line more towards that way. Uh, I'm towards the right, towards the right. Yeah. Hey, wonder a bit. Hey, but keep the tension on it, keep the tension on it. Okay, nice. Hey, wait. Okay, now slowly, slowly. Hey, just keep your rod up, okay? Okay, just keep your rod up. Um, don't wind, don't wind, don't wind. Just keep it I'm just keeping rod up, just keep rod up. Just keep it up. Fish is coming up slowly. Hey, hey, just fire the rod down, not with your line, okay? Okay, wind it a bit, and now just push straight back up. That's the way, that's the way. Hey, just keep rod up, okay? That's the way, that's the way. Nice. Hey, hey, keep rolling up, just keep rolling up. As my fairway, I'm going to fish off the surface. I think it's a big drama. Just keep it up. Yeah. I'm, not, I'm just getting the camera down there. Oh, nice fish. Nice. Wow, nice. Wow, nice. Wow, this is the biggest drama I ever landed. Yeah. Ah. Here you go, all yours. I'm um, just hold up like that. Oh no, hold it here. Hold up. Hold up. Yeah. Happy. <laughs> it's a good size fish. It's a good, like, 
45. Congrats. How was that for a flight? It's crazy, eh? How's the rod pull up? He pulls it right, eh? As in, like you, he has like you think it'll break, but it holds pretty well. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, I'm yes, maybe he or something. It's wrong central place. Yeah. Wow, this guy's fat, man. Congratulations. It's a good sized fish. Hey guys, Gabe from Mercy Fishing Lifestyle. Um, just a few things um, about safety. As you can see, I'm wearing plates. Firstly, um, they help as they prevent slipping on the rocks. Um, as well as the plates, it's important to wear a life jacket, as you can probably see. Hey guys, um, this is just a brief um, explanation of the rig. Um, as you can see here, we have the we have the stopper bead. Um, you can use any small bead that you have, which uh, um, which won't um, allow the stopper to pass the actual float. So um, after the float, uh, after the stopper bead, you have your float. As you see, I'm, I'm using a 2B plus G3. And followed by that, we have the rear cushion stopper. After that, we have a small swivel. Um, after the swivel, we normally use a fluorocarbon trace. It can be of from around 4 pounds to anything up to around 30 pounds. Um, on the trace, we'll normally add a split shot or two, depending on the size of the float. Um, after the after the split shot, right at the end, um, you want to place your hook down. But this is just a brief uh, diagram or explanation of the rig. We've got a double hookup at the moment. Um, I'm not sure what it is, but it looks like they're both decent sized fish. I think Tony's one is a blackfish and Jeff's one is... Here's a better, here's a better view. So there's a pike and a blackfish. Hey guys, it's Gabriel from Ice Fishing Lifestyle. Um, this is just a fish that we've caught so far. We've been fishing for around two hours. Uh, we're fishing off the coast of Sydney, 
Um, as for bait, we're using baits such as prawns and fresh calamari. We've got two bream, around uh, four blackfish, a trevally, a leather jacket, and a pike in a sweep. Um, we're fishing at a depth of around four to five meters, and we're boiling with bread, anise, and, and prawn pellets. Um, as for the rig I'm using, um, I'm using a 2B float, 